Today I'm going to show you how to represent inequalities which take the form y is less than a or y is more than a on a coordinate grid. So first of all you need to know what type of lines you need to draw and whether you shade above or below the line. So for y is less than a you do a dash line and you shade below the line. For y is more than a you do a dash line and you shade above the line. For y is less than or equal to a you do a normal line and you shade below. And finally for y is more than or equal to a you do a normal line and you shade above. So let's have a look at the two examples here. So example 1 we need to represent y is less than 2 on a coordinate grid. So the first thing we need to do then is think about how we draw the line y equals 2. So this is just a simple horizontal line which goes through the y-axis at 2. And the next thing we need to do then is just think about what type of line this is going to be. So if it's less than we need to do a dash line. So if we get our coordinate grid and we need to do a dash line which goes through the y-axis at 2. and we need to shade now below the line because this is where the y coordinates are less than 2 so if we just mark the shaded region as y is less than 2 so let's move on to example 2 so this time we need to represent y is more than or equal to minus 1 on a coordinate grid so again we just need to think about how we draw the line y equals minus 1 so this will be a horizontal line going through the y axis at minus 1 and for more than or equal to we need to do a normal line and we shade above the line so if we get our coordinate grid then so we need a normal line going through the y axis at 1 sorry minus one and we need to shade above this line because this is where the y coordinates are larger than minus one and if we just mark the shaded region as y is more than or equal to minus one thanks for watching